What's the NFL's go-to snack that fuels the pros on game day? If you're thinking high-protein shakes or exotic health foods, think again. NFL players, yes, including stars like Travis Kelsey, are devouring something far more nostalgic and unexpected. Welcome to a peek behind the scenes of the NFL's favorite guilty pleasure, where teams consume over 80,000 Uncrustables every season. Let's dive into how these beloved sandwiches became a staple in the diet of elite athletes. Believe it or not, one of the biggest snacks in the NFL isn't some high-tech, nutrient-packed energy bar. Instead, it's a classic treat you might have loved as a kid, Uncrustables, the famous peanut butter and jelly sandwiches without crusts. According to data compiled by The Athletic, NFL teams are consuming over 80,000 of these prepackaged sandwiches every season. From locker rooms to planes, Uncrustables are fueling players before practice, at halftime, and even after the final whistle. But how did Uncrustables become the snack that NFL stars can't get enough of? It all began in the 1990s when former college receiver Len Kretschmann and his wife, Emily, introduced these crust-free sandwiches. They come in various flavors, are sealed and round, and are designed for easy, mess-free snacking, a perfect fit for athletes on the go. Travis Kelsey, the chief superstar tight end, isn't shy about his love for Uncrustables. He's claimed to eat more Uncrustables than anything else in the world, and he's not alone in this obsession. NFL teams go through up to 4,300 Uncrustables every week, with the Denver Broncos leading the pack. Broncos players devour around 700 Uncrustables weekly, more than double the next team in line, the Seattle Seahawks, who consume about 320. Some teams, however, haven't hopped on the Uncrustables craze quite as enthusiastically. The New Orleans Saints and Cincinnati Bengals reportedly consume the least, with each team eating only about 50 Uncrustables per week. And a few teams are old school, opting to make their own peanut butter and jelly sandwiches instead. While the NFL has long provided traditional snacks like sliced oranges during games, 36 slices for the opposing team, to be exact, the trend is shifting. Now, Uncrustables are a staple halftime snack. The 49ers tight end George Kittle has shared that he eats at least two Uncrustables during every flight to an away game, and up to four on the way home. His quarterback, Brock Purdy, even munched on one in the locker room before facing off in Super Bowl 58. It's interesting to see how something as simple as a PBNJ could capture the hearts and stomachs of professional athletes. With easy packaging, familiar taste, and the quick energy boost they provide, Uncrustables have cemented their place in NFL culture. For these athletes, it's more than just a snack. It's a moment of comfort, a reminder of simpler times. Travis Kelsey summed it up best in a conversation with his brother Jason, saying, I eat Uncrustables probably more than I eat anything else in the world. It seems that for NFL stars, when the pressure's on, sometimes all you need is a little taste of home. And that's the inside scoop on the NFL's favorite snack. Whether you're a hardcore football fan or just a lover of PBNJ, Uncrustables have earned a surprising place in the big leagues. It's a small but sweet reminder that sometimes the simplest things bring us the most joy. Thanks for tuning into the fame journey. If you enjoyed learning about this unexpected NFL trend, give us a thumbs up and subscribe for more behind the scenes stories. And let us know in the comments, what's your favorite game day snack? We'd love to hear from you. Catch you in the next one.